that Tesla had to change their logo for the Model 3 on the website from the three horizontal lines to an actual numeric three. Um, at first, we all know that they tried to do the Model E and then they couldn't do that because of Ford. So then they did the three horizontal lines and now Adidas doesn't like that. So now it is going back to just the three so they will not be bringing Sexy back. But, They're having um, an identity crisis. They, yes. they really are. You know, they, they tried the, the Model E back in 2014 and Ford said, no, it sounds too much like the Model T. So they said, okay, we'll do the three horizontal lines. And as of last week, there's a court filing uh, by Adidas in the U.S. Trademark and Patent Office that says that the logo identically resembles ours and we've spent hundreds of millions of dollars in promoting our brand under that logo and Tesla can't do that for the Model 3. So I see where Adidas is going, but at the same time, I'm kind of sad because I liked, I liked the way that looked. I liked the sexy. But um, I guess it is what it is. <laughs> and I think that they should just start naming the Tesla cars after Tesla YouTubers. <laughs> they could have the Kim, the Bjorn. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. I'm <laughs>
let's see this. Doing this one-handed here, so I'm putting in the 110 volt. I'm gonna plug this in. Okay. Pull it really hard so All you. All right, don't touch it, Liam. Kim, do you want to keep Liam away from the cable? And let's see if this reaches, or we need to maximize our our reach. We might need to maximize. Look how close we're getting. Could it reach up and over? Ah, <laughs> this is funny. I think I think we could reach if Liam wasn't down there tugging away at us. Yeah, we could reach. Thanks, bud. Here we go. All right. Now we just got to make sure the little one. Thanks for your help, Landon. Perfect. And look, we're pulling juice. We got green lines. The yurt doesn't look like it's on fire yet. So we are good to go. And that's right. We are yurt charging. So here inside the car, we're charging right now at a rate of two miles per hour, getting 12 out of 12 amps. It says more than 24 hours needed to get to 90%. And our extension <laughs> with this did wonders. As long as you get the little one who doesn't unplug us over there. Sweetie, please don't touch. Mac here with firewood delivery. <laughs> and my uh, sad attempt at trying to make a fire. <laughs> it's been a long time. But you know what else I have? Thank you. When did you come up with this idea of firewood delivery to, to the camp? house up here when I retired. I'd, I'd live uh, just like a mile from the entrance. Uh, I like working outside. It's one of those things that yeah. like, when you think about it, it's going to be like so much more magical than early. <laughs> you gotta battle these two boys. Yeah. <laughs> charging at about three miles per hour now so we are doing well and we're actually we didn't even need to go supercharge On, Mama Tesla. Vultures. <laughs> awesome. I'm, getting, I'm so tired that I can't even remember what the phrase is. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best part of waking up. Yes. <laughs> I knew it was something like that, but that's how tired I am, and that kind of says how our night was. Yes. Because this little monkey over here would not sleep. He wanted to be in bed. He wanted to have a snack with him in the bed. And when I would try to take it away, he'd scream, Mine! But we're making the best of it. Yeah. Get started on our hike this morning. discovered this little restaurant in the back of actually a gas station um, but it's perfect for us right now um, we're just casual we just went hiking all day long and they actually had coloring books and crayons and this is kind of exactly what we needed yeah they had a fancier restaurant around the corner but I think this is a little more appropriate for yeah. us today thank you appreciate it back and get back after the sun sets in Atlanta. Hopefully the kids fall asleep in the car and transfer and we can just have a relaxing evening in our house. All right, so that's it. We're packed up. We're about to head back to Atlanta. We hope you enjoyed watching us on this journey as we charged our car from a yurt. 
and it just really goes to show that you can still travel, destination charge, do everything that you would normally do. Um, this time we actually didn't even need to charge on the way up here because we could have just charged from the earth. Once again, we'd like to thank one of our sponsors, Evoto, an EV rental company out of Montreal. They are at S's, X's, and soon Model 3's. Be sure to check them out. We're also going to be doing a raffle soon with some of our Tesla prizes, and we'll draw names from our Patreon subscribers and those who've used our referral code this year. Thanks for watching.